What's up guys, Gary with Self Taught Dev. Today we're gonna to go over how to host a static site with GitHub pages. I've had a lot of people asking me where they should host their portfolios and GitHub pages is a perfectly viable free option for you. So let's do it. First off, you do need a GitHub account. So go make a GitHub account if you don't have one. And then once you're signed in, it should bring you to a page that looks like this. Mine's super zoomed in so you can see everything. We're gonna click on the plus in the top right click on new repository. Now the naming convention for the repository has to be your username .github.io. So mine would be ghughes13.github.io. And then the description, description we're gonna leave that blank. The repo is gonna be public. Anybody that goes to the URL is gonna be able to see your site, so don't put anything on here. You want to be private. And then we are not gonna initialize with a readme because we wanna make sure it pulls from the index.html, not the readme.md. And we will click on create repository. Now a few quick caveats, the file cannot be bigger than one gigabyte according to their docs. And it has to be a static site. So you can't host like an e-commerce store or some social media app through this. It's gotta be a static site. Those are the only two though. So now that we've got the repository set up here, we are going to get the URL. We're gonna open up our terminal. I've already switched to documents slash GitHub. It's just where I like all my GitHub files. And we need to clone the repo. So we will do git clone and then throw in the URL. We got the white space at the end of the line. If you have white space at the end of the line when you paste it into the terminal, it thinks you're trying to execute the, execute the command. So git clone, there we go. And we have cloned the empty repository. If we do ls, we can see ghughes.github.io right there. We're gonna go ahead and switch into that directory. Now, this is where if you have a portfolio that's built already, you would move your files from your portfolio to this folder. If you're building a new portfolio, you can build it in here. But this is where the portfolio files need to go or the static site files, whatever you're putting on here. I don't really have anything I want on here, so I'm just gonna do echo hello YouTube. And we're gonna put that into index.html. And then if we ls, there's an index.html. And if we cat index.html, it says hello YouTube is in that file. Now your index.html has to be at the root directory to make this work, so make sure it's at the root. But you'd have all your files in here now. So now we just want to push this back up to GitHub. So we'll do git status and git add a to track that file. And then we'll do git commit m created index.html. And then we will push that back to GitHub with git push. And give it a sec to push, sweet. So now if we refresh this page, our index.html is on there. Now to get to our GitHub Pages site, also you're only allowed to have one per, per user. So there's that too, forgot to mention that. But you just copy this, throw it in the URL bar, and then we've got Hello YouTube right here. But you would have your lovely little portfolio or static site or whatever you're trying to host. So that's about it. You can set up the readme now. And we'll just call it the repo name, commit the file. And we've still got that. Sweet, so we're all good to go. So if you want my resume template, look in the description. I will have a way for you to get that. I build projects, practice projects for aspiring front-end developers. One of the most important things if you wanna become a developer is the projects you have built because that's kind of like the proof that you know what you're doing, the proof that you can build stuff in HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and whatever. So if you want free projects, come join the Discord. I build a new one every month. And all my socials are in the description if you want to connect or have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment below. And I will see you next time. Peace. Round one.